How does our understanding of faith impact the way we live our lives each day? Join me as we delve into the Word of God to discover profound insights. Let us begin by lifting our hearts in praise and gratitude to our Heavenly Father, who is the source of all wisdom and truth. Father, we thank you for your unending love and the gift of your Word that guides our paths. Today, we seek to grow deeper in our understanding of faith and its transformative power in our lives. Now, let us turn our attention to Hebrews 11, 1, which beautifully declares, Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. In these words, we find a profound definition of faith that invites us to explore its rich meaning and application. This chapter, often referred to as the Faith Hall of Fame, highlights the exemplary faith of various Old Testament figures. The author of Hebrews encourages believers to emulate such faith, understanding that faith is not wishful thinking, but a confident assurance in God's promises. Faith, according to our verse, is the substance of things hoped for. It is the firm foundation on which our hopes rest. It is not a blind optimism, but a grounded confidence in the faithfulness of God. Moreover, faith is the evidence of things not seen. It is the conviction that God's promises are as real as if we could see them with our own eyes. Consider how this understanding of faith reflects in our lives today. In a world filled with uncertainties, faith becomes our anchor. It empowers us to face challenges with courage, knowing that God is faithful and His promises are true. Faith shapes our perspective, allowing us to see beyond the visible circumstances and trust in the unseen hand of God at work. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, in the midst of life's challenges and uncertainties, help us cling steadfastly to the essence of our faith. Lord, guide us in every step reinforcing our trust in you, that our faith may grow stronger and our journey more closely aligned with your divine purpose. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. May the Lord bless you and keep you, dear brothers and sisters. Until we meet again, go in the grace and love of our Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you all.